Big pink wellies. Um, as you can see, we've got quite a few people on here. This is just one of the fields. We've got eight fields to go at. So, um, yeah, we're in like I think it's just between like Cambridgeshire and Essex. Loads of history around here, so I'm just going to get on with it. And try and find something decent because those people have started already. They started before we should. People started like 10 minutes ago and saying like five to nine. So I'm going to get on with it. And see what we can find. See you on the first good target. All right, everyone. I'm about three targets in. I've had like a little crappy button. Um, a little bit of lead and a piece of coke I think it was but I think I might have my first coin and I think from here it looks like it might be Roman I haven't actually picked it up yet let's have a look I'm hoping it is I reckon that's a toasted Roman you know not much on it well, not anything on it to be honest but I reckon that could be a Roman it's a good sign. I was hoping to be on the Romans today. There's been a lot of Roman stuff found around here, so cool. All right, possibly, possibly a little toasted Roman. Right, I'm hoping for better than that, though. All right, let's keep going. All right, guys. Straight after that little grotty Roman, I just got this one here. I haven't looked at it yet. Ah, oh, it's a shotgun shell. It had that little green colour to it, so I got excited for a second. But, oh well, that's the way it goes. I'll see you in a bit. Alright guys, I think I've got a little, well hoping it's a little coin inside the clod there. Can you see it? Hoping it's a coin and not a button. Let's have a little look. Um, wait a minute, I've lost it. Oh, that's no, a bloody button. Always the way, isn't it? Oh well, right, on to the next. Alright, I just got this one. A um, little piece of bronze. Not sure what it is. Could be something Roman, but I don't know. I thought it might have been part of a fibula at first, but I'm really not sure. It's just a broken piece of bronze at the moment. That's all I can make out of it. But hopefully, we'll get something good around it. Right, see you on the next one. And uh, next one's just a little piece of lead. On to the next. All right, the next one's in here. Uh, not sure what that is. Oh, it's got some details on it, whatever it is. some sort of brooch. That's pretty nice. I haven't had some brooch of some sort, so I would have had a coin pin going across there. It's definitely got some nice details on it. I might give it a little squirt and I'll um I'll come back to you in a sec. Alright guys yeah that's nice that is whatever it is. I reckon it's some sort of brooch it would have had some sort of silver gilding on there I reckon. I don't know what that picture is. God knows what sort of age it is. I mean, we've got so much history around this area. It could be bloody anything, right from Iron Age to bloody modern, who knows? But uh, that's nice, wherever it is. Any ideas? Stick it in the comments. I'll try and find out. I'll put up a little description after this if I find out. Yeah, lovely. Right, let's see you on the next one. Uh, next one guys is a little um I think it's Victoria Farvin, I think by looks of it. Uh yeah, you can just about make out the Victoria there, I think. Little Farvin, lovely. Alright, on to the next. Alright guys, there's the next one. 
I reckon that's got a Roman look to it to me. I'm not sure really, but it looks like it's got that sort of Roman look about it. I might be being a bit hopeful, but what's wrong with that? Um, I'm not sure what it might be something else, I don't know, but I'm going to say it's Roman. I don't think it's part of a brooch, maybe part of a strap end or a buckle or something. But yeah. That's good as it's got for the last half hour or so, it's gone a bit quiet. I'm going to move on to another bit of field in a minute, so... Right, I'll see you on the next one. Alright, next one's just this little button. But, you know, it's got quite a nice little thing on it. Some sort of library button or something. And it's pretty cool. Alright, see you on the next one. Alright guys, <coughs> I thought this one was a ring ball at first, but it turns out it's a nice little buckle. I think it would have had some silver gilding on it. Is, I thought it was like a big ring pull. I'm pretty sure that's a little buckle. Cool. Yeah, it would have been quite a nice one actually. It's got some little bit of detail on there, a little bit of silver, silver gilding. That's yeah, not a bad little buckle. Right, see you on the next. Alright, next one guys is something I haven't had for a long time. It's a little crotal bell. It's a broken one, but I've had one for ages. It's smashed up. Only half of one box of it. Yeah, cool. I ain't had one for a while. Not nice to get them. I don't know why. It's just always quite nice to get them. Yeah, cool. All right, on to the next. All right, I've got a coin, guys. Next one is a quite a modern one, 1963, I think it was. Little crown, a well, big crown. I've never had a crown before. Actually, They're quite big coins, aren't they? Yeah, 1963. Elizabeth II, not that old, but still a coin. Right, on to the next. The next one, just a little crushed up thimble. I'm actually getting quite a lot of finds today. Loads of different ages. Quite happy with that. Yeah, smashed up, but yeah, it's a nice little thimble. All right, see you on the next one. All right, just stopped for a little bit of lunch. Thought we'd have a quick look at some of the bits I found so far. So this little thing here, I thought was a brooch at first, but it's too big to be a brooch, too heavy. Um, turns out it's a horse mount um, 19th century apparently so not as old as I was hoping for but it's still quite nice though I like that I'm happy with that Got a nice little pattern on there um, got the crown not too special got grotty Roman I'm sure that's a Roman not much nothing on there at all though to be honest pretty toasted um, button Um, yeah, what's that? It's got the crown. And a few other bits on there. A uh, little buckle. Would have been silver gilded by the looks of it. Got a nice little buckle. That little bit might have been part of a strap end or something. I don't know. I was going with Roman, but oh, I don't know. Probably wrong. Um, well, so I've got the crotal bell and the thimble as well, which is in my bag. Um, yeah, it's not too bad. It's about ten past one now. I think we're finishing at about five or six. I'm not sure, to be honest. Um, yeah, it's got a few more hours. We're going to hit a couple of different fields now. See what else we can find. So I'll see you on the next decent one. See you in a bit. And we've got another piece of lead. Uh, possibly a palm guard, I suppose. Could be. Fits in the palm nicely. So yeah, probably. Right, moving on. I right, just got another coin, guys. Completely toasted, though. Not a clue what it is. Got a little bite taken out of it there. But yeah, God knows. There's nothing on that, I don't think. Can't see anything. Oh well, on to the next. Right, guys, just got the next one. I'll sing green. Let's see if it's a button or a coin. I'm going to say button, as it normally bloody is when I do this. Oh, dropped it. Um, that's a coin, but it's another toasted one, box it. Yeah, it's another toasted. Don't think we're going to get anything out of that one either. Might be a George. Something like that, maybe. Don't think it'll be a Roman. It's too round for a Roman. Right, I'll see you on the next one. I right, just got a nice little watch winder. It's not too bad. It's not very fancy or anything, but 
something different. I have one of them for a while. Lovely. All right, on to the next. All right, just had this little half a buckle. I think that's what it is anyway. Probably would have been quite a decent one back in its day. Might have even had a little bit of silver on there at some point. Yeah. Um, yeah, not doing so well at the moment. I'm up right on top of this bloody massive hill and there's loads of vine everywhere so I'm trying to work my way through it hoping that there might be something decent in it but found a few bits, random buttons and stuff but nothing exciting. Might stop working my way back down the hill now. Not got long left, maybe an hour or two so hopefully there's something good to show you soon. All right, see you on the next. All right, just had this one. Just literally, I just had that buckle just over there somewhere. Just come over here and got this. I'm not sure if it's a coin or what, really, to be honest. It's, I thought it might have been like a broken Roman, but I'm really not sure. It's got, it looks like it might have had a hole there. But it doesn't go all the way through. No, it does go all the way through. I don't know what that is. Is that... I don't know. Is it a Roman? And something else, I don't know. I'll have to have a little look later. I don't know if there's anything on that side. I can't see anything anyway. Right, it's starting to rain now anyway, so right, see you next. Right, so I've got another little thimble, smaller one. I'm not sure, if, is that broken off the top or is that how they're supposed to be, these ones? I'm not sure. But yeah, uh, another little thimble, two thimbles in one day. Lovely job, Lee. Right, see you next. Now, this is just evil. I really thought that was a little silver coin for a second, but no, it's a bloody button. It's so annoying, but I've had loads of buttons today that I haven't bothered filming because obviously you don't want to see loads of buttons, but yeah, it's another one. Well, I've got about an hour left now, so something good's coming, I know it is. Come on, all right, see you in the next one. Hi right, guys, we've got another one. Could it be a coin or a button? I'm hoping for a coin this time, come on. Let's have a look. What do you think? Can't be a coin. Nice Roman coin, that'd be nice. Come on. Ah, you little. Ah. Another button. Oh well. Right, guys, I just broke this clod open. This one looks a little bit more promising. I'm hoping this one's a coin. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, no shank on the back. That looks a bit Roman y to me. Come on. Yep, yeah, that's a Roman. Get in. Oh my god, I worked my ass off for this. The hills I've climbed, seriously. Right, I don't think there's very much on it. I'm not I'm not gonna rub it too much. But um yeah, I'm gonna say that is definitely a Roman. Whew. Okay, that almost makes it worth it. I'll be happy with that. I've walked some miles today, I tell you, I am knackered. Not got long left, gotta start heading back towards the car. Right. If I clean it up any better, I'll put some pictures on afterwards, but I'm not sure I'm going to do much to it, to be honest, because I know that these are like, they just get worse the more you try and clean them, so. Right, see you on the next one. Right, got another half decent button. A nice little design on there. One of the better ones I've had today, out of the millions. Right, I reckon I've got about half hour to go, so. I'm going to try and squeeze out another Roman if I can. A nice silver one would be nice. All right, see you on the next one. Right, guys, I think we've got another coin here. 
Um, oh, it's bloody thin. It's like a hammered. That's not a hammered. It's too green to be a hammered, shall I? Oh, I'll tell you what, that's, that's interesting. Is it a jetton? But it feels really thin, but it's really light as well, so maybe it... Hmm. I don't know, it feels like a hammered, but it doesn't look very silver. Alright, let me give that a little clean up quickly. I'll get back to you once. Alright, yeah, I think that's a hammered. I don't know if it's one of those Irish ones, I'm not sure. I haven't seen it before, but... It definitely looks like a hammer to me. Doesn't look very silver, but probably hasn't got very high silver content or something, I don't know. But I'm gonna say, I've just got a bloody hammer get in on the way back to the car as well. Always the way, isn't it? All day, bloody walking up and down hills trying to find something decent, and it's the last half hour I'll get some good stuff. the end of that then guys i am knackered seriously i have walked so far today jesus there's so many hills as well it was just tiring but it was worth it in the end got well i got my roman what i set out to get it nice been nice to get a silver one but beggars can't be cheesers i suppose but um yeah and i got that little hammered at the end i'm sure it's a hammered it's a bit green but i don't know if it's like one of those fakes or something i don't know but I'll get an idea of it soon, you probably would know by now, so I probably would have put it after I got it. Um, but yeah, I'm quite happy with that. Loads of finds, loads of stuff, loads of toasted coins, but the actual amount, amount of finds, I've got loads, so I'm happy with that. It's a good day out. Thanks Pink Wellies. Check out Pink Wellies on Facebook if you haven't already. They're a good group, they always get good land around sort of Cambridgeshire and like Essex area. Um, yeah. Excuse me, I'm so bloody thirsty and I've run out of water, so... Um, yeah, so that's the end of that. Um, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.